Would you date somebody that has long acrylic no. nails? No! What if the girl is so beautiful and you just can't? Put your beauty inside me, shine it on me and throw it to me. Jesus! I need you by my side, yeah. Abraham Sour. And today he's representing the male gender. Yeah, bro code, man, bro code. <laughs> and I'm going to be asking him some questions that ladies would love to ask the men. So let me ask you this very first question. Okay. When you're in a relationship, yeah. would you allow your partner to see other people? Well, if I'm in a relationship and my girlfriend wants to go and see other people according to UK. Let her just go and pass. <laughs> not stopping you. You can go for your date. Go and enjoy your time with a man. Wow. But just pass there and go. You guys do it. So how come you guys do it is not a problem. But when the ladies do it, it's a big deal. I trust myself. Friends so you don't trust your girlfriend? I do. But we all know that women are gully. Can you, can you do without sex in a relationship? Are you asking me? Are you asking me on behalf I'm of I'm asking you on behalf of the male gender. And I'm asking you, you need wow. to give your own personal opinion. So, I don't have personal opinion. You cannot set me up. So everybody will say I'm not righteous. I'm a man of God. Sex is forbidden before marriage. That's what the Bible says. Yes. Yes. Depends on your partner. Some people are just there, logs of wood. They don't, they don't want anything like that. But, um, what do you mean by logs of wood? You just said it yourself that sex is for marriage. Yeah, so but the thing is, most guys cannot do without sex. Yeah. Okay. Maybe some people can do without sex in a relationship, but me. I said for me, I'm a Christian. You're a Christian, but yes. you're saying you cannot. I'm not. I didn't, I didn't say I cannot. What I, is, I, I just said. Okay, so next question. Um, the phone. Hey, see, his girlfriend is even in wallpaper. Oh, Jesus, I got love. Oh, Jesus. How personal how person, how is your phone? How personal is my phone yeah, to yeah. me? Very personal. Mm -hmm. so Why? If you are dating now, your boyfriend cannot go through your phone. See, today is about the male gender. And don't don't make been, it about. You have been us. giving me bad boys since. I'm not into high, so mm -hmm. why? <laughs> If, if you already know the password to my phone, if I give you the password to my phone, it means okay, that let me, let me rephrase right now. Let me rephrase. Would now. you give your partner the password to your phone? Yes, why not? So that means for the bros, man, <laughs> you are not answering the question. No, but if you have nothing to hide, why would you have a problem with keeping yes your partner or going no. to your phone? To your phone. Yes or no? I don't think I'll have a problem with you. Yes or no? Yeah. Okay, good. I'm proud of you. I go through my phone, but you'll find anything there, so. That's why I want them to come and open a DNA, a DNA testing center in Benin. We all know the story now. Mm -hmm. Most of the time, people will carry somebody's child. What about the men that have children outside that their wives don't even know about? That one is different. How is it different? How do you allow a man train? How would you allow a man train on that person's child? Women have other people's children in their matrimonial home, lie to their husbands about it and make their husbands train these children. I'm sorry, I don't see what your point is. My point you is... You are saying, you are justifying it on the part of the man. Yes, yes. And saying it is injustice in the part of the woman. It's wickedness. On what size? It is wickedness. On how many wives did your father have? One. How many wives did your father's father have? One that one. My father has one wife. Mm -hmm. My grandfather had nine wives. My great-grandfather had 12 wives. And? And they all, they all lived in peace and harmony. No, they did not. Yes, they did. Let's try to see there, was, there, was, there was no quarrel. See, everybody had their own time of the day where they were going to satisfy chief. I see why you call yourself a chief now. I am a chief. Marry no, I'll marry just one wife. I'll but you have girlfriends. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not going to have any girlfriend anyway. But I'm asking, why can't women not just encourage their husband? When a woman has a boyfriend outside, her heart and her body is with that boyfriend. Mm. When a man decides to have a girlfriend outside, his heart is still in his house, 
He just wants to satisfy that's his sexual urges. That's what you guys see to But is it true? Is it true? better. Is it true? God gave Adam charge over everything in the garden. Okay. That was the first instruction And he for gave him how many women? Just one. Yes, I agree. Okay. He gave him Eve. But he said, take care of everything. Everything. Meaning the animals, the trees, Yes. The and I said, man, I'm supposed to take care of everything. So how does that relate to So I can take care of outside. you as my wife. If I see a woman outside, I can take care of her too. It's the instruction that God has given. No justification I'm, I'm a man for, for having... I'm a man for equality. I'll take care of you, I'll take care of my girlfriend. If that's the kind of life you want to live here, yeah? why would you not subject a woman to that in the house? What am I subjecting? Don't marry at all. What am I subjecting? So that we will know that you just want to have Different concubines and different girlfriends should... like Solomon. He breaks the trust and the Which bond trust? between you and your wife. You not break any trust. It does. Bond. Okay, but you can give me another person's chair to train. It will not break trust and bond. I am not justifying that. I'm not saying that it's good. Okay. What I am saying is, on both sides, it is wrong. No. You see, you guys, you can see the kind of person he is. My face, but inside his heart, see, my heart is there. pure. I'm, I'm the... Inside she... his heart of heart. She knows that I am a very good person. Mm. I like to say the truth. You know, most women don't like the truth. The day we marry, we hate his wife like this. Why is it that sometimes when guys are trying to, um, when they are trying to woo a lady, yeah. hmm, the initial stage, you're trying to get her attention. Mm. Then when you now get the lady's attention, mm. so now be like you are giving less attention, less time, less everything. Why is it always like that? If I go and buy a lady, that's Oh god, you are your parables. Just I'm a believer to give you parables. See, I told you before I'm an elderly person. When you go and buy a shoe from shop price mm -hmm. and you pay for the shoe. Okay, let me say that like you see the shoe the first time, you like it, and then you 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 don't have money to pay for it. You now go out, puzzle, and come back and pay for it. And you now take the shoe home. Please, my people help me to answer. We used to be going to shop right tomorrow and look for that same shoe again. Mm -hmm. What? You won't understand. I'm dropping. I'm dropping parables from the past. You are giving me a headache. That's what you are doing. No, I'm not Stop trying to evade the question. Why is it that the beginning stage, people are sweet, people are romantic, you're going on dates, you're taking her out. Then when you now finally hit the jackpot, like when you finally get the jackpot, what's the jackpot now? When you finally get the girl, uh -huh. you now forget. Like you now, your your effort is now reduced. You're just relaxed. The I've energy only, is now. I've already got to you as my woman. So what should I be stressing? When you were wooing this your girlfriend now. She knew, like, I, she knew I was a house person. Yes, but were, you, were there not things that you were doing that you're not doing anymore? No, I still do everything I was doing there. Yeah, exactly. I'm not lying. Let me call her now so that you ask her. I'm, I'm not lying. Is it money? I used to send her money before I said anything happened. I still send her money now. She always knew from the beginning I was not an outing person, outing person rather. So till now I don't go out, so I'm always in my house. But like I said before, I've already gotten the jackpot. What should I still be stressing? You put, we may even like it. It's not about stressing. Women are the problem of this world. Yes, I'm anti feminism because they cannot be gender equality. You don't even know the definition of feminism Please, because what to me. you people think, what you, explain to me now, what what you call feminism mm, mm. is not it. Oh, yeah, explain what feminism is. In your people's opinion, feminism is, oh, the woman wants to be in charge of the house. No, you want, to have, want to have equal rights. No, no, you want to have equal rights. You want to have equal rights. You want to do this and that. You want That's to have equal rights with the man. Exactly. Even the Bible doesn't say you will have equal rights with the man. The Bible has said that women be subject to your husbands as your husbands are subject to the church. How does submission have to do with you? Your Most Nigerian right. women who become feminists are no more submissive. I have the opportunity to give a woman a position of power. I won't. Except maybe like you can I may give you that because you will give me because you know I'm but most women do not. Once they have the position of power, they believe that nobody can talk to them and they can just do as they like. Come on now. No. Okay, next question. Would you date your girlfriend if you knew she dated your best friend? No. Why would you be my friend? I mean, I am my girlfriend. Then we break up and you go and ask the girl out. Come on, bro. Don't do this now. Don't do this. That's it. No, but people do it. If it's my real guy, you will not do it. Mm. You know how many women I say? So that means when I was dating my girlfriend, you were looking at her ass when she was passing. Yes, that's what it means. Except you didn't know. Then I'll just feel like, okay, this girl is my ex, though, and you want to continue. And you ask me what happened, and I tell you. No, but he has genuine feelings. And that does not like... concern me. You are not my bro, bro. 
So you are going to end your friendship? I'll dead it. Okay. Okay, so next question. Let's say you are dating a girl and you bring her home to your mom. And your mom doesn't like that. You keep dating. Talk you... to my mom now. Why don't you like her? What did she do? What did you what did you notice? Because you know the African mothers are, are, are prayer champions. So probably there's something she saw in the spiritual realm that I didn't see. So if your mom says, okay, I've seen some unfamiliar spirits. I'll pray myself because I told you, like I told you guys before, I'm a man of God. When I talk to my creator, I will know what to do. If God says go ahead, I go ahead. If God says stop it, automatically I get it. But do you think you're in a position to see that she's not for you? Yeah, I know I'm beclouded by yes, love. Yes, you're beclouded by true. love, emotions. This is a hard one. But I think if my mom says that she saw that the girl is a witch. Maybe not a witch, but she, she just tells me the girl You know when you meet me. someone and your spirit doesn't really align with the person, that's an indication that the person is probably not right for you. Yeah, true. Yeah. And mothers have that kind of instinct. I follow my mother. My mother is my best friend. So I follow my mother. The guy you're dating right now. You have to bring the guy I'm dating to all this. You do have to do this. <laughs> I think I have one more question. Shoot. Would you date somebody that has long acrylic? No! I, I saw one I was like this. Did you not like it? God forbid. I'm a I'm a I told you I'm a girly person. It just wants one more Can you guys? Some girls who fix those kind of videos, ask them if they can take it home. Why not? They can't. So they're following their mother is. Somebody they won't like try it. me, Sha. My mom likes my acrylic nails. Yeah, that's your mom. Does your dad like it? No. Okay. You see? <laughs> and that's a beginning man. That's, that's, <laughs> that's us. Or it shows that the child doesn't have home training. Excuse me. Are you kind of acrylic nails? You'll be ash. <laughs> oh, you want flair? <gasps> I'm not talking about the ice cream. Oh, this lens oh, is good. Yeah, this lens is good. What, what is this? this? Yeah. So you can never date any. It is so I, <laughs> I won't go talk to you, not me date. It is so normal. Wait, wait, wait. What if the girl is so beautiful and you just can't? Put your beauty inside the shine box there and throw it in me. Jesus. Isn't beauty. that deep? It's deep. Very deep. Same way makeup is deep for me. So it's you don't like much. makeup? I do. It's beautiful. Thank you. But some, some girls, when they do makeup for you, they'll be like the mommy. Look for what fits your color. This one now is fine on you. Some people. Hey God, never seen me call before. <laughs> Sister Rashida, well done. No, but if you have an event, you need to go all out. Yes, yeah, go all I out. Need to do like your this. this is beautiful. What you have now is beautiful. Thank you. Some people make up. You will go. You will go. Really? Yes. Okay, your skin yes, color will be, will be chocolate. Your makeup will be yellow. <laughs> yellow. What the fuck? What's the yellow? Let's carry your face there. Yellow, yellow face and chocolate skin. Why is it not now this almost every girl has been here? Why are you looking? Come on, I told you as a man, God has been giving me the instinct to always appreciate you. See, everybody's doing ash. Well, I'm not here. Jesus Christ, <laughs> bruv. I said everybody now has big butts. How do you guys doing this thing? And ah. they're going to do it now, Italy. Everybody does. Ah. in Lagos. Ah. I said, doctor in Lagos that does it. So basically, if you want big nyash, <laughs> if you want big bum. Big nyash. Big bomb. Shake that booty that Jesus gave you. Shake that booty that. If you want big bomb. If you don't have big nyash, you cannot go to the doctor. Like they'll do a surgery on your ass. They'll remove what they do is they'll remove the fat in your tummy and put it in your in your ikebe. Ikebe, so that your ikebe will now stick. So don't be surprised that all the girls in your area have ass because even the ones that have not done it, they wear. Would you do it? Can I do ass? <laughs> Very funny. Give me the money. Let me use the other thing. Do you know the risk that is involved in that? Nothing will happen. Jesus girl. Guy, yeah, Jesus girl. Going to they are going to change what the Lord has already made. Like, that's the reason why all the girls in your area have passed now. Lord is our strength. We faithful men of the nation of Nigeria. We stay faithful. And you know, <laughs> we stay faithful. So guys, we come to the end of today's video. I hope that today's video was um, interesting. And, I did it uh, for the brothers. For the brotherhood. This is 
well with our generation. It's well with so everybody. Amen. Amen. Mm -hmm. Amen. Mm -hmm. Amen. Okay, so please tell them to subscribe, share, and please subscribe, share, watch, rewatch, rewatch again. Subscribe again. Tell your friends to tell their friends to tell. I didn't say that in next week that time. Tell your friends to turn on that friend that I've not heard, to turn on that friend that I've not heard that you should subscribe to this channel. Thank you. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next one. I know it's a blue kiss. Bye. Blue. My girlfriend will be playing blue kiss.